Well, breaking news this hour, a first of its kind study starts this morning to finally determine whether you can still carry or transmit coronavirus even after you're vaccinated. And the study is based in Seattle. The COVID-19 Prevention Network headquartered at the Fred Hutch announced that the study will take place in 21 colleges across the country, including the University of Washington, 12,000 vaccinated and unvaccinated people between 18 and 26 years old will participate. It requires them to conduct daily nose swabs if the virus is found. Researchers then do contact tracing to see if the virus passed to others, but didn't infect the vaccinated person. It's funded by the federal COVID-19 response program and the National Institute of Allergy and Infectious Diseases. We had a chance to talk with Dr. Larry Corey from Fred Hutch about this. He's designed this new trial, and we asked about whether the results could make a big difference in the way we operate as a society. Listen. It make a big difference. Um, when we gave a party or had someone over, or went to a restaurant, um, you really wouldn't have to feel that you are the one who could potentially transmit to someone else. Yeah, that could answer the question about do you have to wear your mask even mm -hmm. after you're vaccinated? Everybody is asking that question, and this could be a really, really important study. It starts right here in Seattle. Yeah, it'll be a while before we can remove our masks until we get that data back, yeah, right? Yeah, because for sure. we want to make sure that we're staying safe. And that's important for people to keep in mind because you think once you're vaccinated, we're good. Right. But it depends on the other people if they're vaccinated as well and how much you're still, you know, could be a danger to somebody else. Yeah, bottom line, still get vaccinated, still wear your mask, yep. even if you're vaccinated. But uh, more data is always good. Knowledge is power when it comes to this coronavirus.